so today I have a review from Honey Fan. Y'all, so I wanted to swatch my Honey Fan that I just bought me because she's having a big sale. Okay, so I'm just, I changed my mind. I wanted to use the natural swatch sticks instead of the clear. Okay, so that's what that's about. But anyways, Honey Fan uh, had a very big sale and on her princess collection. So I had to go grab me some of her princess collection um, acrylics because her acrylics are super buttery, you guys. And you guys are going to see once I start swatching them, um, you guys are going to see um how easy they are to work with okay so you guys sit back relax and enjoy um i did buy one of the acrylics in a double so that was my bad um <clears throat> but that's okay you know i could just put it in the collection and um yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys real quick these are the numbers they're all they all say princess on them because it is the princess collection uh the only difference is the number on there so okay this is the one i got doubles of which is fine i'm not mad about it because they were on sale okay and then i am using my enel couture monomer and i'll be using this cat's brush that i found i had it uh many of you know that i'm moving stuff out of my nail room and i just been finding you know stuff that i didn't even know i had so i'm like let me use this brush um just to see if it still works okay because it does have a little boo-boo on it but we're gonna work through it and i want you guys to see how uh amazing this um acrylic is to work with okay so uh like i said sit back relax enjoy now real quick now it they it did marble guys but once you guys bring it you know down the nail and you know as you working it and molding it into the nail it goes away so initially when you pick up the bead and you put it on the nail it's gonna marble because you know the pigment or whatever and but once it's on the nail and you you wipe it down the nail it's fine like it goes away the marbling goes away so i just wanted to point that out
Now I'm gonna try to like stir it up and see if that helps with the marbling. But like I said, I mean, you guys been seeing like the other swatches, they've been marbling, but it has been like going away after you, you know, pat down the acrylic. But I did stir it up just to see what it does. Um, but it's still, it isn't a big deal, you know? So yeah, I just wanted to point that out. This is the last swatch, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this small little um, video of me swatching some Honey Fan. Guys, it really, truly is buttery. The only other acrylic that I know of that is that has, per like, that I've personally used and has been this buttery is Drea's uh, Dream Nail Supply. Hers is also very buttery. So if I would compare those these two, they have like the same consistency. They're very, very good to work with, you guys. Um, Drea's Dream Nail Supply and Honey Fam are magnificent um, acrylics to work with. So I totally, 100% recommend Um I am a beginner. I'm not like super good at acrylic and look at it. I mean, it doesn't go anywhere. It doesn't slide to the side. It's not runny. It's, you know, I'm able to just put it where I want it, you know, and it does not move. So please try it out for yourselves. Uh, you won't regret it. So I hope you guys have a blessed day, you guys. Don't forget to hit that like button, comment, share my video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye, you guys. Peace.